Hey YouTube family, this is Francie with Finding Joy. Wanted to show you a van that I looked at on Saturday, Sunday. Looked at this on Sunday. It's a Chevy Express, a 2008, I believe. And um, this is what it looks like. I think the body is in good condition. There is some rust on the bottom. It is from New York. There's wires hanging all over the place. I'm not sure what those are. Leather seats. Um, here's a little video. I have a couple of videos of the inside. Those circles are windows that they spray painted white because they said most people want a cargo van with no windows. But he said I could peel that off. So I'm not sure if it will peel off very easily. I hate to start it and then it doesn't. And I'm not sure what those wires are for. I really need somebody to educate me and tell me what everything is for. Floor looks nice. Won't take long to clean it up. All right, I'm in the van and I drove it down the street. I don't want to get out on the road and all that stuff. First of all, there's no rear view mirror. There are windows in the back. Oops, horn works. So I'm not sure. Oh, you can't see. Hang on. Let me switch it around. All right, so I am test driving the van. It is a 2008 and it has low mileage. It only has 80 something thousand miles. Um, it doesn't have power windows, which I don't care about. That's one less power thing to worry about. It doesn't have power locks. It's, and um, it's just a clean slate, really. Just a clean slate. So I would definitely have to do a little more research about insurance and that kind of insurance. Insulation and how to make the walls. And so let's look around a little bit. The only thing, I don't like that the seats don't have arms on them. Uh, in one respect it's good because you can even go into the cab easy. Um, and I know people have put like a swivel on this one. They're leather seats, so that's nice. It's got one plug there and one plug over there. So let's get out. All right, so this is the driver's side door. It's kind of dirty, but I'm sure this was used as a work van. He said they check everything. It did have a message about the tire sensor thing. They do have new tires. The tires look really good. And I'm thinking I read something about the brakes. So here's the front end. And actually, the body looks amazing. It looks nice. Um, tires are new, so that's amazing. I don't know what type of warranty as far as, you know, if they'd help me, but they do service vehicles. So if something goes wrong, they would service it. And here's a muffler thing sticking out. I don't know, you know whatever. The tires look good. And those are windows, so I'd like to try and scrape that paint off and use them for windows. It'd be nice if I could find a circular fan that would fit there, an exhaust fan. But um, I think I did a little video. So here's the inside. It's, you know, it's everything I needed. It's a little bit bigger than a minivan, but that's good. You know, I'm gonna climb in and see about, stand. I can, no, I can't stand but just kind of see how it feels. And then I gotta make a decision. I would have payments with this because it's a newer van, obviously. And um, I don't know what those would be yet. So I've gotta find that out. So here it is. And then look, it's even got a trailer hitch. So whether I could pull a small camper or I think it's just to put like that cage thing in the back so I could carry bikes or even a scooter or a generator if I went to a big generator for air. I don't know. Um, but it's there. So it definitely checks all my boxes. Definitely does. It doesn't, oops. It doesn't look too sketchy. My daughter's always like, don't get a sketchy van. Okay, I don't know. It's not staying out too good. I think he just did it with one screw. Um, yeah, she's like, don't get a sketchy van. But let's take a look. Does it look sketchy? I love the little windows. I bet somebody was going to convert this. 
So I can't see up the top. There's some duct tape up there. Hmm. You know, it's not gonna be perfect. It's just not going to be perfect. Somebody must have done something up there. But uh, let's climb in it and see how that feels. It's a video while I stand in there. Um, it's probably about this, eh, it might be a little bit taller than a minivan. Um, I would definitely have to put insulation and a ceiling up, so that will come down. I don't know, it just checks all the boxes. So let's go back and talk to them about the history, see what the warranty is on this, and make a decision.